Good morning, everyone. I guess I'm doing like a vlog a day. Let me put this over here. Um, today is Wednesday, and um, I'm near where I have to be in Northridge. I stopped here on the way, but this I'm in Northridge. I'm in a parking lot, and uh, I'm not going to say where I'm at, but um, I, I'm about 10 minutes early to this 9 o'clock program. And now I'm only going to go three days a week, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday from 9 to 12. So I, oh, right now from a few days ago. So I get out of here at 12 and then I'm going to the Kaiser lab because my primary physician wants me to take some labs. I guess I'm due labs. I saw her, um, I usually see her once a year for a physical exam, but it was less than a year. And I saw her for a few things. Um, this is my primary, not like any doctor. And um, yeah, she put some labs in for me. So I'm gonna do them. Um, I didn't have time to do them the day she put it, them in for me. So I'll probably get there. It's in Woodland Hills. I'll probably get there. Um, let's see if I leave here about 12.05. It's about a 25 minute drive, so about probably 1230 and the lab will probably be crowded because a lot of people go there for lunch during lunch their lunch breaks I think I don't have an appointment with the Kaiser lab near me you can get an appointment so but the most I've had to wait in that lab a long time ago was like half an hour but lately it's been like 15 minutes and what's good is on my plan I don't have to pay a coke payment I used to be on a different plan where every encounter in the lab, no matter how many um, tubes of blood were drawn or how many tests, it was one price. Even if you had one, like if your doctor wanted to have one, it was like expensive, it was like $25 for one test. So um, now I'm glad they changed it as of a long time ago actually, where it's free. So if you just need one test or five tests, it's the same price. It's no price. It's zero. <laughs> that It used to be like for $25, you could have as many tests, including just one or two tests. So I used to try to save them up like for my yearly physical exam because then they were all done at once. So yeah, I've got to get in here. I've got about uh, seven minutes and i um, got to get there. And um, I, um, today I didn't stop and get a coffee and a donut because I've been doing it like the last week and a half and I've gained weight. I'm almost overweight now, you guys. So I've really got to watch it. Um, I've been eating really good lunches while I've been here from 12 to one. So, uh, really good food. So what can I say? I've been eating kind of fattening, but healthy. And that's how I've gained a lot of weight in the past uh, month and a half. So, anyways, now I want to lose like, uh, maybe like three or four pounds. I'm not overweight, but I'm borderline. Okay, thanks everybody. I'll upload this uh, right now. It's going to be on my data, so, my data, so I don't know how fast it'll be. Um... Yeah, I haven't had my morning coffee, so I'm going to have it here. And I think maybe tomorrow I'm going to stop and get a donut. I don't know. Oh, no, I won't because I'm going out to lunch with my mom and I will make a video. And when we go out to lunch, um, I am going to get something fattening. So, which is cheese quesadillas with guacamole sour. They serve it with guacamole and sour cream and then I put salsa on it really good. It's huge because it's like an appetizer there. So it's meant for you know, two or three people. I'll probably take some home. I have sour cream at home, but not um, guacamole. So, and guacamole goes bad if you take it from a restaurant. It turns like brown. I've tried it. <laughs> so, okay. I'm going to go in now. Take care, everyone. Bye.